Denver 7 On Demand is brought to you by Ferguson and BAC Appliance Center. The best in bath, kitchen, and lighting for your home. I'm Tom Mustin with the latest from Denver 7. Denver police are investigating racist graffiti sprayed on a home in North Denver. These images are spreading fast on social media. We've had to blur out some of the images, which include a drawing of a lynching. Councilman Albus Brooks says the crime is despicable. He says the city will not take it. It's a night we were all waiting for. American Idol returned to Denver 7. And tonight, a teenager from Highlands Ranch wrapped his way into the judges' hearts. Nick Rogers was one of several contestants featured in the Idol commercial during the Oscars. And tonight, we saw his audition, and he got a golden ticket. Nick is a senior at Mountain Vista, Vista High School. He told us he's been singing since he was a toddler. We'll be cheering Nick on as he moves to the competition on American Idol again right here on Denver 7. All of our recent snow has really increased the avalanche danger in the high country. This slide was caught on camera by Denver 7 viewer Jacob Easton. Jacob sent us this video just outside of Copper Mountain tonight. You can see at the end, if you look closely, snow engulfs the vehicles there on the internet. Look at that, on the interstate rather. And we're told, luckily, no one was injured. And from the First Alert Weather Center, meteorologist Stacey Donaldson is here with a check on your forecast. That avalanche danger, something we'll be watching this week. Absolutely. An avalanche warning remains in effect for our northern and central mountains until early tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, very cold temperatures. We're starting out with a wind chill advisory early on tomorrow morning. That's why we have that First Alert Action Day continuing into those early morning hours. Wind chill factors between 10 and 20 below zero. Our high tomorrow, only 22 degrees. Then we'll be in the 40s and 50s as we round out the week and that sunshine showing up just a little bit more. A welcome sight there. Thank you, Stacy. This has been your Denver 7 On Demand update. Thanks for joining us. And check back here later for another update and download the Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Tom Mustin. Have a great day.